Hey, it's Caps Carcast. It's all hustle. It's all hustle. Let's drive. Get down. Get down. Get down. Yeah, this isn't going to be what you expect because I can't look up. I, I love Gary Vee. I love him. I think he's a genius. I honest to God do. If you're not watching him, I think you should. But not for the reason you might think because he's all about, um, you know, hustle this and hustle that. And yeah, I agree with that, right? Uh, but it's more than that. It's more than that. That, that. There's so much packed into that word, right? And everybody hears that word differently. There's a couple things going on, right? Another thing that I get kind of... Um, uh, concerned about is when you tune in to watch somebody share something or they're going to have a guest in their podcast and that guest is going to be dropping value bombs or knowledge bombs, 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 bombs. It's more than that. Same thing. It's more than that. Is that these things matter? Does value and knowledge matter? Sure. No, absolutely. But you're not going to go to a, a podcast uh, or, or somebody's course or watch Gary Vee episodes for a month and all of a sudden turn it on. It doesn't work that way because it's a lot deeper than that. So it's all hustle. What I mean is every things are found in the tiny, nitty, gritty details. Improvement is made only in the constant exercise and discipline of what we're doing. And I mentioned it before in a previous podcast that it has a lot less to do with uh, productivity and a lot less to do with specific areas of hustle and everything to do with the proper and necessary habit building. And I am so much more convinced of this you know, halfway in, almost halfway in to 30 days or 31 days of blogging every day in August than I was before. Because th by doing it more, and listen, to give you some context, when I started the car cast in 2015, give or take, I was doing them once, twice a week. I didn't really have a firm direction in mind, and I was self-conscious of doing it. Those things existed, okay? I've done 60-some-odd episodes since. I've never done as many as I have in the past week and a half. And it's been incredibly eye-opening. It's awesome because I know where I feel comfortable. I can know where my sweet spot is. I'm able to map out what I'm talking about and be focused about the areas that I'm talking about. I understand where and when I ought to reach out to. I can pay attention to different things in my content production and the way I'm consuming content and how I'm looking at my analytics and how I'm tying it to the way I develop business and the way I serve my clients. It and that's all from being very disciplined about one key area of my content. I've even been, able to, excuse me, even been able to write a little bit more here and there. That doesn't happen. None of that happens unless I build the discipline of habit. Even tonight, it is Sunday night, right? I haven't done my video today. I was at a party all day for a friend's baptism. Just got home. My wife threw the kids in the pool, and I'm out here. Listen, I usually drive. I'm not going to kid you. I drive around uh, because I'm out and about doing what i got to do. I used to do this in front of the camera. That's another story while I was driving. Uh, but I'm literally in the driveway because this is my setting. I feel comfortable in the setting, and I wanted to communicate this to you. So, yeah, listen to Gary Vee. Go watch him and do what he says and all that because he's a media genius. I really believe he is. Or go tune into that webcast that you're going to look at next week or that live video or take that course. All those are great things. But until... And unless you put these things into a disciplined, habitual practice, it doesn't matter at all. It just doesn't. And I think that's true for everybody. This might be my opinion. I know it's true for me. I sincerely, look, I've been in my career for longer than I care to admit sometimes, right? Um, I think there's a lot of wisdom packed in there. And I want to share that with you, that it's the habitual practice of discipline, the disciplined, habitual development of those good habits. Anyway, it's all hustle. It's more than just the word. It's the nitty-gritty details. It's slugging it out every day, getting better, paying attention, staying focused. That's all I got. It's subscribe time. Yep, it's a habit as well. I ask you to come on over and subscribe. The bigger question is, why are you in the habit of getting to this point and not subscribing? Start good habits now and subscribe. See you next time.